Well, high school seniors face, of course, a time of great transition as they prepare to take the first big steps into adulthood. At one CCSD high school, students can access the post. It is a place for students to find the tools needed to succeed after they graduate. Vegas PBS media crew member and Sierra Vista High School student Ezekiel has that report. Hi, I'm Ezekiel Day from Sierra Vista High School and I'm part of the Vegas PBS media crew. Today I'd like to shed some light on an important aspect for the academic journey for students in our community. Many high school students are unsure about what career path to pursue or where to begin their college search. That's where the post-secondary center comes in. It's a one-stop shop for everything students need to prepare for college and career success. What is the post? So the post is short for the post-secondary center here at Sierra Vista High School. And really, it is a space that is multi-purpose and welcoming to make sure that all students have an opportunity to have a place where they can go to develop their future career plans and to get the support that they need. How does the post-secondary center help students prepare for college and career success? Um, when students come to me for the first time, if they're not 100% sure what exactly they want to do with their future, the first thing we do is some self-exploration activities. So we learn a little bit about their strengths and weaknesses, um, what their interests are, and how that might relate to possible career options for the future. Once we've narrowed it down a little bit, we do a little bit more digging, some more education on those options, and then it's exposure. Um, taking field trips, um, bringing in guest speakers, and really making sure the students know what their opportunities are. Um, and then finally, it's support. I'm here to make sure that everyone has the opportunity to reach their future goals, no matter what that looks like. The center offers college and career counseling, college application assistance, job readiness training, and much more. How has the post-secondary center helped you so far in your college and career planning? So the post gives me an opportunity to like actually focus on college-specific stuff, such as scholarships. Um, for me, the post introduced me to some colleges that ultimately seemed like untable at the moment, such as Princeton. They came and visited us and gave us information that made it seem more like um, realistic for me to go there um, and introduced me to other colleges like GCU that wasn't something that was on my radar, but um, in making my college decision, it was one of my top two decisions. What advice would you give to other students visiting the post for the first time? Go to them yourselves and make the first move, take the initiative, because for me, the, uh, the post was such a, a great help and I wouldn't be as productive as I was, and so I'd recommend they take the initiative to go first. Everything's obtainable and you can do whatever you need to do, especially with the help of Ms. Rowan and the Post. What do you think makes the post-secondary center an important aspect here at Vista? I'm really excited about the post-secondary center because I think kids really need a place to go to say, what am I going to do after high school? And up until this time, they don't really think about what happens after high school. And so either that or they just think college, college, college. But the reality is that there are so many options that are not college that our kids can, can benefit from. Thanks to the post-secondary center, students have access to the necessary tools and knowledge to chart their own paths for success. With the guidance provided here, not only does it prepare students for the future, but it also inspires them to shape it. The post-secondary center serves as a critical resource for students in our community. I'm Ezekiel Day with the Vegas PBS Media Crew, signing off from Vista Station News here at Sierra Vista High School. Thank you so much, Ezekiel, for that excellent report. Now to Foothill High School, where students continue our series on interviews with members of the CCSD School Board of Trustees. Foothill students Shiloh and Chris sat down with trustee Lisa Guzman, who represents their district, District A.